Let's do an old start, cold start of course. On the PM2200i, it's been a while since I even, yep. Uh, still got fuel in it. It's getting older by the time, I don't think it's been ran since uh, maybe November or December. I can't remember, but. And we're gonna fire it up today. Because if we lose power here at the house here at our house, then we're gonna need this. Just figured I'd get it going early. Just in case. You can see everything in here is just iced over. So I'm gonna just wheel the cart. Um, I'm gonna point it outside the door. I'm not actually gonna put it out there because you know, freaking snow out. Yeah, we're supposed to get two to four today and six to eight tomorrow. But yeah, let's see how this thing will start. Uh, I'm gonna have to turn the fuel on. I turn it off every time. We'll put it in the dry stuff. Okay, use this for the holding my phone. Get a little exhaust view. It's probably gonna take a little bit to start because it's been oh man it's been like maybe four months maybe since it was last running okay vent on and the economy on now joke we go Uh, it's probably going to keep, take, it's probably going to take a while to fire. I thought I heard it. No, not yet. Fuel's been off too, so it's got to get through there and crap. I want to see how full it actually is. Still got quite a bit in there. But this fuel is from September. That's how old this fuel is in this generator and it's February. So it's five months old this fuel. Okay, we're gonna get serious now. Yeah, we're gonna let her run forever. She, she did start not that she actually didn't start too bad. I knew it wasn't gonna be very easy. Because it sat for since and it's got September fuel in it. So that's why I like starting it up. There we are. And she's condensating. Oh yeah, there we go. Gotta love it. Precious uh, power, mate. There we are. We got a green check mark. We're good. We don't have a red one. You like that? There we go. 